2016 NCHA Great American Insurance Group Summer Spectacular. We just had the first final of the event, the John Deere division of the five and six year old, and that was taken out by Grant Simon on Elite Cat, who scored a very solid 222. Congratulations to you, Grant. Thank you. Thank you. So, how does it feel to be the first champion off the block? Uh, it's amazing. I, I was hoping it would work out that way, having two shots at it, and yeah, no, it was excellent. Very good. Yeah, great effort to get to into the final. Who, you know, coming into it, who would you have put your money on? Well, the mare's just been so solid. Um, the other horse is, a, like, yeah. I think a lot better horse, but he's had a lot of fast runs, and um, and I've only had him for a month. So that other mare I've had for a couple of months and got to show her a bunch and, and really got comfortable with her, and she's got comfortable with me. So, okay. so um, she lived up to her name tonight, Elite Cat, because you're, you know, in a class of your own, you won by some three points or so. Yep, yep. Uh, take us through your run. Well, just being second in the in the draw, got to cut the cows that we wanted. Um, they settled really soft, and then the first horse they stung up a little bit, so we cut the the softer end of what we liked, and they were excellent. Got 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 them cut clean, got them cut good, and um, that mare was just really smart and going hitting that, them stops and getting comfortable in the ground. So that that draw helped more than anything. And there were seven in the final tonight. Is it easier or harder when there's less cows? Well, it's different when you're sitting up there and you look down and it looks like there's 14 cows in front of you. But it's good. You can get a good, get a good quick list and, and, um, and I, I didn't mind it at all. Okay. So you've had this um, horse for a few months. Tell us about, you know, tell a little bit about her, why you like her. Well, she's, a, she's just a very smart, strong mare. Um, she was, she was excellent as soon as I got her. I just changed a few little things with her just to get a little bit more comfortable for me and my feet, how I use them, and, um, and got to show a bunch. Jerry let me go. Like I went to Hamilton and showed at Silverado. We had a five-day show before this, and I showed her twice, and she was really, really good the second day, and I didn't show her again. Gave her a few days off and let her get comfortable, and, and yeah, I marked an 18 and a half in the first go. It really surprised me because she's a little bit greener, and being a six-year-old mare, she hasn't been shown a lot, and... And came back and had a good draw, marked a 16 and a half. I thought I could have marked a little bit more, but but um, yeah, it was really good to to get up into this deal and and get a good draw and and get it done. So now this is not your first final here in the Will Rogers. Tell us a little bit about uh, your cutting history. It's been a while. When I was at Slate River, I won the I think it was a Super Stakes Limited in like 05, and um, I made a couple of couple of Futurity finals right then. Made a couple of semi-finals at the Futurity, and I've made a few limited finals. I think I was, I may have been reserve on a horse when we were at McDavid's on Spork, and then I was I was reserve at the Futurity in the limited on Little Jackson Cat, and that was the last really really good run I had in this pen other than tonight. So, so you're now working for yourself um, under Jerry for Jerry Durant, I should say. Um, it sounds like we're going to see a lot more of you now. Yeah, I, hopefully I've got a really good string, got an excellent bunch of three-year-olds that um, everyone else that rode them had done a terrific job on and, and we're going to hit a bunch of the small futurities and try to finish this mare out. She's six, so try to hit a few of them small futurities and try to do good in the five and six-year-old and get her earnings up a little bit. She's a full sister to a, one of Jerry Durant's um, really good brood mares, a mare called Swiss Cat. So he's always really loved her and wanted to see her do good and maybe we'll just do it the last end of a six-year-old year and I think she'll be a good Mercurial horse next year. So Perfect. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, thank you.